A young Polish scouts were volunteering on Sunday um, at a reception center at the Medica border crossing to provide immediate help to scores of exhausted refugees arriving from Ukraine. As thousands of Ukrainians continue to cross the border every day, the extent of the desperation and exhaustion of the flee civilians is met with generosity. Around 20 young scouts from Poland's ZHP scouting organization were among the many volunteers helping refugees as soon as they crossed the border. The young scouts who came to Medica from across the country sleep in tents in nearby hostels to be able to provide daily help to those fleeing the war with Russia. They serve warm food and drinks, offer blankets, and a place to rest as majority of arrivals at the reception center in Medica are women with small children who are extremely tired. Meanwhile, displaced Ukrainians began arriving Sunday in the self-proclaimed Donetsk People's Republic, or DPR, from areas of fighting further to the west. The DPR covers an area of eastern Ukraine held by pro-Russian separatists. The DPR's Ministry for Emergency Situations is overseeing the shelter for the refugees near the coastal village of Bezamin. Most of those displaced come to the outskirts of the strategic port city of Mariupol or nearby villages. The agreed upon humanitarian corridor to evacuate civilians from Mariupol has collapsed for the second day running as the Russian and Ukrainian sides trade accusations of targeting civilians. Meanwhile, hundreds of Russian tourists were stranded on the beaches of Cuba and the Dominican Republic flew back home on Sunday. At least four flights were scheduled to take off between Sunday and Monday morning between the famous Cuban resort of Varadero, Moscow. According to an airport official who asked not to be named, some 1,800 Russian citizens are expected to leave the island in the next hours. The Russian embassy in Havana reported on its Twitter account that the day before, a first group of 300 uh, citizens were uh, transferred from Cuba on an Aeroflot airline plane. The Association of Russian Tour Operators indicates that around 18,000 tourists from uh, that country are stranded in different destinations in the Caribbean because of the airport sanctions imposed on Moscow. Russians uh, represent an important segment of the tourism industry in Cuba, which has been hit hard by the reduction in the flow of visitors due to the pandemic. Meanwhile, in China, state media CCTV reported some chartered flights carrying Chinese citizens fleeing war-torn Ukraine have landed in four Chinese cities. The broadcaster's footage showed four chartered planes landing in Lanzhou, Jinan, Hangzhou and Zhengzhou over the weekend. Uh, some evacuees were seen waving Chinese flags as they disembarked, while others waved happily at the cameras. Chinese citizens in Ukraine are being evacuated to neighboring countries such as Poland and Slovakia before boarding chartered flights to take them home.